Hey, we are with Will Devon. Hi there, hello, hello. Welcome, welcome. So, we just finished a very successful uh, media launch for One Warrior Series Philippines, so I'm really excited to, to, to show the world what exactly this series is all about. All heart, all passion, humility, uh, humor, all elements in one. So, all right. September, September 18 on GTV. All right, so speaking of One Warrior Series Philippines, tell us about how long was it filmed? And uh, tell us about, of course, the experience when you um, stay there. Was it your first time to be in La Trinidad Benga in I Baguio City? Man. I've been to La Trinidad Benga before, but it's a glit lang. Like, um, naman Session Road or you know the, the Strawberry Taho to experience for a weekend, but I've never been um, uh, saturated with such beauty actually. For seven weeks in Benguet. Seven we were weeks. There for seven weeks, seven to eight weeks more or less. And it was an amazing experience. But Una Una, uh, the weather, it was uh, beautiful. Uh, that was definitely one of the things that I that I missed returning back to Manila. Mm -hmm. But the entire experience of being able to um, be in a series uh, like One Warrior was absolutely uh, life changing, to be honest with you. The, the discipline that I saw. The, the, the warriors go through and that the coaches actually led mm -hmm. uh, it even manifested through me mm -hmm. uh, I see how hard people work I see how hard uh, people their desires are met mm -hmm. where their dreams are, are being lifted so many different opportunities that I saw and uh, the, the harder you work the closer they got to their dreams so I, I look at that as an absolute inspiration yeah. And you you worked with Team Lakai people. Yeah, and the, did the you champions of the world? Team Lakai, Coach Mark, uh, the current champion as well, Joshua Basho, mm -hmm. and also uh, Coach jo uh, Jay 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 Stakio. Yes. Unbelievably humble individuals. Like, mm -hmm. I, I did not expect that uh, from from world champions for them to be so humble. And did you expect them to be cocky? <laughs> I, I did. I, I, you did. I, I never surrounded myself with. Um, Fighters, if you will, but there's so much mm -hmm. more than fighters. They're, they're family men, they're teachers, they're, they're coaches, they're, 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 they're a little bit of everything. And it was really, um, I had to unlearn many things about myself too, because the, wow. the, not the uh, judgment, but let's just say assessment that I had of them initially oh. as fighters were a lot different. Fighters in general. Fighters in general. And even okay. watching the fights now, there's so much more art. Uh, in what I watch now, compared mm -hmm. to before, it was just like an uproar of, let's say, of, of the past of, let's say, uh, Greco-Roman uh, Colosseum and everybody yeah. just wants blood. Gladiators. Like, yeah. and, like, it's so much you feel, so much compassion and, 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 uh, and heart towards these modern day warriors. That answered my next question. So, <laughs> oh, did okay. It, did, it, did you get the chance to train as well with the Team Lakai I people? I did actually on my own time because uh, una, una, I didn't want to clearly make it about me. This is not my time to train and mm -hmm. ask the coaches right. questions. This was about maybe 16. after, but not maybe during. After, but not during. <laughs> right. Of course, I thought about it. Like, oh, I didn't train because I'm the 16 uh, athletes, warriors. Yeah. But then I realized that wouldn't be the right move for me. Yeah. It's their time to shine. It's their right. time to have the spotlight. It's their time to fulfill the dream. So whenever they were done, uh, I would have my own moments with Coach Mark and, and, and Joshua and Jay, yes. asking them questions of you know, discipline and what are their workout programs. And I would do that on my own a lot of times. But sometimes I would, yes. I would have the opportunity to train with them. And area. of course, they will welcome you very welcome. For sure. Absolutely welcome. I hope. But my season two, sana sa gym na lang ako mag stay. Yes. <laughs> no joke. Like, I really. And you'll be included in one of the challenges, <laughs> right? As a fighter. I know, exactly, right? It's a bultong challenge. Yeah. It's a bultong challenge. The show is about dreams. So I want to ask you about. I want you to compare yourself when you were still dreaming and with what you are now. Wow. I'm sure you have achieved some of the dreams that you that used to be just dreams to you before. Yes. Um, you know, it's a, that's a very good question. Now, I'm at a point in my life now where, and I realize this as I'm getting older, the things that you're looking at. Look. Well, look, I, I am a huge believer of self-discovery mm -hmm. now, especially as you get older, and it's about conquering the things that you are afraid of. Whatever you are afraid of. 
more or less, that is the direction you're supposed to go. I remember when I was very young in high school, and I've always wanted to act. I've always wanted to speak. Mm -hmm. But believe it or not, I had the most ridiculous sense of fear of public speaking. Oh and yeah? I remember signing up for drama mm -hmm. and going on stage in the first day of class, having to go on stage, I couldn't speak. My whole body was shaking. Uh, it, it, I, I completely froze. I blacked out. And I remember that it was such an amount of fear that right after class, I went straight to the counselor and nagpalit ako ng course to oh. um, home economics. <laughs> home economics na lang. Like baking and... Oh no, sorry, not, not home economics. Um, it was... Um, yun, yun, home economics. Yun, tama. So baking and... Culinary. You know, culinary, things okay. of that sort. Things of, so rather than being on stage, I hid away okay. in a corner. And, but I realized that that couldn't that couldn't last long because you, because you don't grow through that. Mm -hmm. In your own way, you grow. But whatever you're afraid to do, um, that's that's the route you're supposed to take. So mm -hmm. some of the dreams that I, I have is happening every day, even just now, uh, with being able to stand on stage and overcoming a fear. But it's not, that's already a dream come true. Mm -hmm. Whatever that may be, overcoming your fears, that's already a dream come true. So whatever you're afraid to do, again, uh, that's that's where your dream lies. From there to now, hosting I'm one hosting Warrior Series one Philippines. Warrior series. Philippines right. uh, reality-based show of drama, of art, of, of, of everything. It's uh, really a dream come true already. Speaking of drama, how's your love life now? <laughs> I'm back. You know what? That's a very. It's good an ob obligatory it question. Um, to be honest with you. I am at a point right now in my life where I'm focusing on myself. I, I really am, like jumping from relationship to relationship. I, I've clearly I've done that, and I've learned so much from many of them. And thankfully, I am still also connected with many of them in, in my own way. Uh, even to, I, I'm not sure if many viewers even know this, but I have a beautiful baby boy. Congratulations! Uh, and. Uh, I don't want to say unfortunately, because I don't believe in that. But me and the mother, we did split. Okay. But our co-parenting relationship is phenomenal. That's good like, to know. It's it's divine, to be honest with you. I'm so thankful for her mm -hmm. that we can beautifully co-parent in such a cooperative, beautiful way to bring up our son in the best way possible, which is, of course, love. Mm -hmm. That's it. Drop the ego and just focus on love and being a nurturing parent. So um, that happened actually during during the COVID lockdown. You know, I, I can probably speak for many people, but it don't mean easy people. The COVID lockdown, what that did for many people, especially in relationships, it was either they, it solidified a relationship or it showed them that you're not compatible or things aren't just the way you thought that it would work because you're inside of a house Mm -hmm. You have to get to know each other. <laughs> you have to spend time with each other. You right. start to see little things here and there. Especially if you uh, jumped into the relationship, you know. Uh, mm -hmm. But you know, I'm, I'm very grateful for where I, where I am in my life. I'm very grateful for my son, uh, who is my heart, who is my everything. Uh, Magnus Orion, maybe one day you'll see this, if not. Um, That's a beautiful yeah, name. name Magnus Orion. Super handsome boy with curly hair, just like that. <laughs> of course. I'm myself, um, and I think that's a very important thing. I, I, I'm taking courses. For example, I just, I just took a, an Ida free diving course, so I'm a certified free diver. Wow. I'm explore more of the Philippines uh, diving destinations, which of course is some of the best in the world, which is the best in the world. Mm -hmm. Speaking of, CNN just recently released that uh, Philippines is the number one tourist destination for diving. Wow. So why not take advantage of that? In the world. In the world. Wow. So why not take advantage of that? Explore mm -hmm. more. Um, so that's where I am. I'm very happy with the people that are connected with me and those that I'm, I'm actually meeting in the process of my journey. So big thank you. Grateful. That's, okay. the, that's the attitude. Great to know. Uh, 
And just invite now. In uh, this is the time to invite the fans to watch. Why should they watch One Warrior Series Philippines season one? Because there are more seasons to come, sure, right? There are more seasons to come. But yes, Monk and Vegan. This is the very first ever uh, mixed martial arts reality-based competition. And it's not only about MMA, but it's about your heart. It's about their passion. It's about their their dreams coming true wherever they are in their lives. They know they can become better, but not for their families. So this show is about heart, it's about passion, it's about uh, camaraderie, brotherhood, and all of these things together. And I'm, I'm very honored to be able to be part of this, to be able to showcase this, to be able to host uh, such a global phenomenon that I can already say, uh, which is One Warrior Series Philippines. So please check it out. It's airing on September 18 on GTV at uh, 9.35 p.m. So please do check it out. Again, very thankful. Will Devon here. Uh, follow me also on Instagram if you can. It's Will Devon. That's W-I-L-L-D-E-V-A-U-G-H-N. And I hope to see you soon. Maraming salamat. Remember that your attitude determines your latitude. And uh, stay grateful and uh, 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 full of full of uh, happiness and soul as much as possible. Thank you. Thank you so much. We'll devote everyone one warrior series one in Philippines. Warrior series Philippines. Yes. Thank you. <laughs>